Oh boy. Welcome to Red Dead. Or welcome back to Red Dead. Yeah, it'd be funny, like, oh yeah, this is the first episode. We deleted all the other ones, and now this is the only yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're in the middle of the story. Get used to it. Actually, I think we're way more than, like... I don't know if this is... I think, I think we're right at the halfway point, because the other chapters aren't as long as the first two. Like, chapter four and five, I think, are relatively short. And then six is the epilogue. I think we're getting ready to wrap up chapter two after we talk to Dutch. Because R.I.P. Sean. Arthur, have you seen that boy, Jack? No. Where's my goddamn son? Where is he? Where's my Shouldn't son? Shouldn't you have kept an eye on him? They took my son. Who took him? We think the Braithwaite woman took him. Oh. Like Kieran saw a couple of fellows sound like Braithwaite boys. Where's my son? If anything... I where is my son? Dutch Bitch, Hamlin? I don't know where your we son is. I just him. got here. Bring him back to you, <laughs> and we will He's sitting by the duck. Have the temerity to touch one hair on that boy's head, Abigail. You have my word. Just get me back, my son. I will get that boy back. So help me God, right now. Dutch, we just heard about Jack. You need some extra guns? Yeah, why not? Micah, Kieran, anyone strange turns up, you kill him. Rest of you. Let's ride. Well, it's nice to know we're gonna okay. solve this Let's in a civil manner. <laughs> yeah, this is very civil. That's what I'm saying. It's like it's a civil it's war a... style. <laughs> oh, I got flu. Uh, turn off the marker. Um, what I'm saying is like it's a camp full of of us who are all trained with guns. How do they kidnap a boy who never leaves camp? That's what confuses me. Because he probably was just on the edge of camp. We have to focus on Jack. There, girl. He was stick fighting a tree. Yeah, and then the tree grew arms and kidnapped him. Basically. How the hell did they get to him? I don't know, but we are getting him back and they will pay. I promise you that. What about the gold? Who gives a damn about the gold? They got Jack. I hate to break He's got a point. I don't think there is any gold. But if there is, it's Easy. hidden somewhere no one knows. What? I've turned every stone. Christ's sake, Hosea. After all that, another perfect scam. Wow, it's almost like our plan didn't go according to plan. That never happens in video games. Enough talk. There is no point arguing how we got here. This is where we are. And we are going to fix it. So By committing mass murder for someone who we just slightly suspect. Hey, this music is getting pretty dope. Nobody makes a move until I say so. <laughs> Get the RPGs, boys. That would be hilarious if I could just pulled out an RPG. Started going to town. Yeah. Hello. Yeah, you just go up there and knock calmly. And say like they didn't hear an entire group of horses pull up. We should have stayed. Yeah. Bit late for that, ain't it? Quiet. We're going to fix this right now. Come on, let's get this done. John, you sure you're okay? Like I said, I'm fine. Yeah, after I kill everybody, I'll be extra okay. Neck families think they can ruin us? I don't think so. There they are. Wait, I want to be in line, guys. Goddamn boy. I'm gonna let fly. I don't know, slavers. John, I need you to stay calm. So I love the opera singer is just going crazy right now. You inbred trash. Ooh. I want my boy back. Even though it's John's boy, but Easy, John. we've come for the boy. 
You must have known we would. Shouldn't have messed with our business now, should you? Whatever complaint you have with us, alleged or otherwise, that is a young boy. And he's gonna That's die, it should be at our hands, not yours. Hand him over. Get the hell off our land. Uh I like we have more guys that we can shake hands with. It's not gonna get violent. <laughs> is that what you call it? This yeah. is gonna be a lot of a lot of shaking you hands blood. See like this is civil. Ooh, headshot. What left? Ooh. I get to open a door. Or Dutch. You don't Take gold shield. I'll take that. Uh, I just kick door open. I don't want to break box. Whoa! Oh, got gotcha you first, boy. Guys, maybe she's just changing. I don't want to intrude. Oh, ow. Oh, I don't need it. I don't need it. <laughs> I don't need it. I don't need it. I need it. Alright, now let me just pop a little, uh... This music's absolutely insane. Let's get some of my dead eye back up. Ow, 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 guys! Oh, top of the head. Top of the morning to ya. <laughs> top You're of the morning. Good day to die. Yeah, John, get out of my way. Uh. I wish Dead Eye was a real life ability. I'm John Brady. I'll say, isn't there a back door? Come on, this must be it. I can't see a goddamn thing. And shit out the window? Yeah, probably not the best idea, One, honestly. Two, three. Oh yeah, baby. It's okay, Dad. I'll just take it from here, even though you're the boss. You want me to kill you too, old woman? You bastards! Where's the boy? We have lived in this house for a hundred and twenty years. We never had no problems except for Where Yankees. Where is the boy? Who took him? You killed my son. Oh, and I will surely kill the rest of them unless you start talking. Oh, I know your time. Come and scum. Where is the boy? You that's filth. Calling him scum, that's what's going to break him. What about them? Uh, ma'am, I'm sorry about your sons. 
Uh, this is kind of, kind of uncomfortable to watch. I don't know if we're gonna burn it to the ground. Uh, if we hear a screaming boy, then we know he was in here. <laughs> you right. I got him. <laughs> Guess that's the end of the goddamn cribbage game. Uh, he, oh, look at all the people taking naps outside. Surely she'll take a nap too. I like how a Yankee's like a slur to her. I never liked you. Why'd you take the boy, Mrs. Braithwaite? You stole Boys my Boys are liquor. off limits. You stole my horses. Ain't no rules in war, Mr. Matthews. Yes, yes, that's it. Where's the boy? My sons gave him to Angelo Bronte. So my guess is Saint Denis. Either there or on my boat to Italy. Let's go. Arthur, come on. What are we doing with her? Leave her. I told you she was crazy. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, she's a little crazy. She walked right in the fire. Yeah, it should be okay. Maybe she's fireproof and we don't know. <laughs> nah, it'll be fine. Don't need someone like that anymore. It's called survival of the fittest. Yeah. It's gonna work out, John. It's gonna work out. Listen to Dutch. Now, I don't expect you to understand this, but I have never been more proud of you than I am right now, brother. You're doing the right thing. Yeah, I'm so proud of you that you lost your son. Safe. Um, she she'll kill us all. I know, but looking at that's where you're more concerned about. Well, that boy is fine. They took him to scare us. Nobody takes a boy to harm him. He's right, John. That is not true. What do you think, Arthur? My boy will be fine. But, well, of course, Marston scared rotten. We, we killed all those people. We stirred up all that trouble. <laughs> for nothing. No. No. Not for nothing. Yeah, it took a I gold mean, shield. We didn't get the boy back. Now we get yeah, the or any of that we rich people's back. money. Trust me. Hey, Dutch. We got a problem. Not a problem. Visitors. A solution. Good day, fine people. Mr. Vanderland. And Mr. your quote-unquote solution is probably a problem. Who are you? Huh. Rip Van Winkle. Huh. Good day, sir. Agent Milton, Pinkerton Detective Agency. Agent Ross. Ah, Mr. Morgan. Nice to see you again. And to what do we owe the pleasure? Agent Moron. I don't know if you're aware, but this, <laughs> this is a civilized land. Now. <laughs> Agent Duty Head. And the guy's like, oh, it, it is on. You to act like human dignity. Girl on the right looks like Fiona from Shrek. Outmoded or not yet invented. This thing, it's done. This place ain't no such thing as civilized. It's man so in love with greed. He has forgotten himself and found only appetites. And as a consequence, that lets you take what you please, kill whom you please, and hang the rest of us? Who made you the messiah to these lost souls you've led so horribly astray? I'm nothing but a seeker, Mr. Milton. You ain't much of anything more than a killer, Mr. Vanderlind. But I came to make a deal. It's time. You come with me. And I give the rest of you three days to run off, disappear, and go and live like human beings someplace else. You came for me? Risk life and limb in this den of lowlifes and murderers so that they might live and love? I kind of... Ain't that I'm, fine. <laughs> kind of with him. There's like nine people I don't surrounding want to kill him. all these folk, Dutch. Just you. In that case... It'd be my honor to join you. Excuse me, friends. I have an appointment to keep with. 
I think your new friend should leave now, Dutch. You're making a big mistake, all of you. <laughs> yeah, dreadful. We have got something. Something to live and die for. How awful for us. Mr. Milton, stop following us. We'll be gone soon. I'm afraid I can't. And when I return, I'll be with 50 men. Awesome. All of you will die. Run Why have had more than 50 in one town Run. before? Come <laughs> That's on. what I'm saying. Get your damn hands off of Remember me, that? Boy. Remember it's that one town now. that we basically eradicated? We yeah, we did it twice. Once in Valentine's <laughs> and once in Rhodes. I know a big old house hidden in the swamps outside San Denis. I'm sure they'll find us eventually, but it should buy us a few days. A few days is all we need. There's a spot out by Shady Bell. Lenny and I got into that dispute with the previous occupiers. Place is well hidden. You and Arthur, right out to make sure no one else has moved in. Lenny, you go follow those fools out of here. Make sure that they leave. And John, we'll get Jack back, and we'll get going. Rest of you, get packing! Come on, John. Next time on Red Dead, he's been Seth. He's been Josh. Bye-bye.